Hello there everyone, my name is Pritam Nikki and today in this video I will be going to talk about how we can install Mac OS X Mojave which is as of now the latest version to your PC. As you can see here, I have installed this to my HP Folio uh, 9480M uh, business laptop. So I'm just connecting this machine uh, to my monitor. So just I'm just replicating the display. So now I guess it is becoming easier and easier to install uh, Machintos compared to a previous version like High Sierra, Sierra, or Mountain Lion. So uh, now we will talk ab about how we can install. Uh, which is our main point so first of all uh, let me tell you that my version uh, I've just uh, updated it to the latest which is uh, let me show you the latest version uh, as of now uh, is 10.14.2 uh, and today only I, I have updated it and you can see my sound card is working fine and uh, not only sound card but my internet is working fine yes but the, the, the problem is with my Wi-Fi so uh, till I did not uh, able to find the driver what I'm going to use is the Wi-Fi dongle which is you know pretty uh, cheap you can just buy a small Wi-Fi dongle and you can use it with your laptop or you can use uh, Ethernet as currently I'm using uh, I can show you like internet and uh, you can see even the sound is working okay now coming to the part like how I installed so I'm gonna show you the video that I have followed and I will also let you know um, like how you can also do this so let's just start the process Install. Mojave yeah Okay, so I have used this video. Hi, everybody. So I will be putting the this link in the description below of my video, and uh, the tutorial is quite simple. I just follow this tutorial to install Hackintosh, and we just need to. I, I will be giving you the link first of all you need to download the Hackintosh from here so uh, unlike other uh, tutorial uh, other popular website of Hackintosh they ask you to download to uh, hack in, um, uh, this version uh, the macOS version from uh, from the official website and sometimes it is difficult because a uh, lot of people don't have Apple already installed or due to n numbers of reason uh, because we are window users <laughs> so the thing is uh, we don't have uh, Apple machine and and we really feel difficulty to really download the Mojave so the easiest way here you can follow this link I will be keeping this link again in the description below and just create your ID and password and after creating ID and password you can download uh, Mojave from here I will just show you the link just give me okay here I have clicked on same link so here you will find out the downloading link here after you signed in and after downloading this Hackintosh you required this etcher 
download this one also and I would suggest you follow this guide this guy is awesome and he have created a very nice guide and he's using a custom build with uh, i7 87 8700k which is currently my desktop is but uh, I'm just right now projecting my desktop here in my monitor uh, I mean my laptop in my monitor so uh, I could able to install machine to Moha uh, Mojave into my desktop PC but the problem with Apple is you all guys know like they don't have enough softwares uh, actually they, are, they don't have that much wide range compared to Windows so I will be using Hackintosh to my laptop and Windows my the lovable to to my desktop so uh, if you also want to do uh, same kind of thing then you can do this so first thing you need to download Mojave from this link and then you can uh, download the this this etcher software this is also available for windows and uh, the process is pretty simple you just follow this video and you can you you will let, uh, this video will let you know how you can create a bootable drive and after creating bootable drive you just need to make sure one thing let me just show you You need to make uh, changes to your bio setting. So uh, I will press start button and then just go to BIOS. Okay. Now bio setup and here device configuration the SATA device type to EHCI we know this and by default it is EHCI only disable uh, virtualization technology for directed and disable fast boot option also and then we will pro be proceeding to our boot option And we need to select UEFI, not legacy. So this is also another basic requirement. And that's all. Just click on yes, and here we go. Then you can plug into your uh, plug in your prepared USB, and you will be seeing this kind of menu. And uh, uh, you can just follow. The description I, I I made this video specifically for those guys which is using the same model because uh, this is the kind of proof that like if if you really want to install machine tools then uh, and if you have got the same model then you can use it so uh, like if you have got so uh, after installing Mojave so you need to boot to your hard drive so the same video have got a very nice description like how you can uh, install Clover bootloader to your PC like I have installed so let's go again to the same video is three three taps here Hi, 
in here. Now, uh, if you have got the latest uh, version of Intel, then it's good, like you can follow the video. But if you do not have uh, the new version of chipset, like if you are using Sandy Bridge or Ivy Bridge or Haswell series of processor, like my current uh, PC, it is Haswell E. So you can go here and download this one. And it is pretty easy process. Just you need to, uh, just you need to follow the video. And if you have got any problem, then you can contact me in comment. And uh, all the thing will work you good. And you can ask me any question and if I know then for sure I will reply you. If I don't know then even though I will try to search it on internet and uh, I will try to answer your question. So uh, you can ask me like uh, other process or if you want me to explain you something else then you can ask me in description. So thank you guys for watching this video and see you soon. Bye bye.